Hey everybody, how's it going? Thank you again so much for being here for another great lesson from Big Wave Guitar. I'm your humble instructor, Dan the Guitar Man. Today we're going to be looking at the classic rock hit, Paint It Black, from the Rolling Stones. It's a great song with really simple chords and an awesome little melody riff for you to learn as well. Uh, but before we jump into the lesson, if you could please be so kind as to like this video and subscribe to the channel. That way you get to stay up to date on all the great lessons, uh, tutorials, breakdowns, and general guitar knowledge that we share here. Uh, it'd be really greatly appreciated. Thank you again so much for being here, and let's get to the lesson. First chord we're going to need to play this song is E minor, which we're going to play by putting our first finger on the second fret of the A, and our middle finger on the second fret of the D, and letting all six strings ring freely. <laughs> The next chord we're going to use for this song, uh, to avoid using a bar chord and making it a little easier, we're going to make uh, the B major into a B7, and we're going to play that by putting our middle finger on the second fret of the A string, our first finger on the first fret of the D, and our third finger on the second fret of the G. And I'm going to use my second finger to mute that low E and play the bottom five. Next chord we're going to need to play this song is D major. We're going to put our second finger on the second fret of the high E string. Our third finger is going to come up and get the third fret of the B. And our first finger is going to get the second fret of the G. And then we're going to use our thumb to mute the low E and play the bottom five. The next chord we're going to need today is our old buddy G major gonna play that with our third finger on the third fret of the low E, our first finger on the second fret of the A, and our third finger on the third fret of the high E with all six strings ringing freely. The last chord we'll need for this song is gonna be A major. We're gonna play that by putting our middle finger or our second finger on the second fret of the D string, our first finger on the second fret of the G, and our third finger on the second fret of the B. Then we're gonna use our thumb to mute the low E and play the bottom five. So let's take a look at that little melody uh, riff in the beginning there. It's gonna start out on the fifth fret of the B string, or at least this where I'm playing, you can play it anywhere it starts on E. It's based on an E harmonic minor riff if that makes sense to you, great. If it doesn't, don't worry about it. Just the more you know. Uh, so we're starting off on the fifth fret. Slide up to the seventh. And then the eighth. Right? Then up to ten. Back down. Right? Eight, seven. So that's the whole thing. Let's do it again. Super slow. So looking at the verse slash chorus, however you want to kind of call it, it's mostly a verse. Uh, it's really the only main part of this song, which is another great reason why uh, we're taking a look at it. Because it's so simple, it's so easy. Once you get it down, you got the whole song. Um, so let's jump into that. It starts on E minor. All right. To B7. Back to E minor. Seven again, and here come the changes. It goes a little faster. It's 
really the whole song. That's, that's basically it. Uh, I'm going to do it again regular speed, and then we'll do it again real slow, okay? Here we go. So there you go, you got everything you need to play Paint It Black by the Rolling Stones. It's super simple, super easy. You've got the verse chorus, you got that cool little melody riff that they play. And uh, I really hope you enjoy putting it all together. It's, uh, it's a lot of fun to play. Um, like I said, thank you again so much for being here. If you could please like and subscribe, that would be greatly appreciated. Uh, thank you again so much, and uh, we'll see you again next time. Be good.